Yo guys, welcome back to another video. Now, I'm actually recording this video last Thursday, and this is going up on a Wednesday, I think. Like, what? It's going up in like almost a week's time. That's insane. But yeah, I've just been recording the weekend's full of motorsports level videos you guys would have seen. But I'm in the same lobby, and it is now C class. And I have actually rented this Holden Tirana Forza Edition because I don't think I have a Forza. Wait, no, I do have Forza Edition cars like the Cadillac, CTSV, and Mini Cooper as well because I won them from league racing. But this is C class, so yeah, I just thought I'd rent it. But anyway, let's get into a race. Okay, so here we go. I'm starting off at the front of the pack. There's about six of us, so oh, it's, is this rear wheel drive? It felt rear wheel drive. There was a bit of tire smoke. It seems all right. What does it look like in tire? Oh, that's mad. Insane. I'm on the brakes. I'm already off. I, I failed. No one else is off, are they? Just me. Come on, catch up. We need to catch up. We need to catch up to these guys. We can't just, like, sit behind. That's. I wouldn't upload that content. If, if that actually happened, I actually wouldn't upload. I was just right about the entire race because it's boring, innit? Need the action with the other vehicles. Like, you know, it's going to be a few crashes, probably. Well, maybe not because there's not many of us, but you know what I mean. Hopefully, we can overtake this guy right here who's in fifth. We seem to... Oh, break him well too early, him. I mean, the short circuit. Pretty sure I said the short race, but I mean the short circuit. Here we go. We can get him. This is a fairly quick car. Forza edition as well. Looks insane. Was a rising edition in Forza Rising 3, which is pretty sweet. Get on the brakes. Oh my god. Why am I going into first? There's seven laps of this. You just can't accelerate much. Not a lot of room for overtaking, really. Not let, let me through, bro. I'm taking out the poor shines. That was a bit of bad racing, but what else can you do? No situations. At least he wasn't put off a circuit, really, was he? So that's good. Tyres look very thin on this thing. Gotta say that. He's far behind now. Come on, bro. Don't need to break that much there. Come on. I've got the line here. He's crashing me. He crashed me. He did actually crash me right there. Now that other guy's coming for the overtake. I'm not gonna let him up the inside. He's on the grass. Oh my god, he span out. I didn't touch him. He went onto the grass himself. He could have braked to slow down. Oh my god, I'm going off here. I don't even know how he crashed that bad, though. I honestly don't know. Seven laps of this is going to feel like a long time. I don't know why. There's nothing really looking to overtake ahead. We're clipping a bit of grass there. And a bit of dirt as well. Don't need to break here that much. Just just not accelerating. No need for no braking. Like, no need for the brakes. Tyres squealing as well. You can just hear him squealing. Took that corner quite well there. Braking was quite well timed. And we didn't go off, which is good. What happens if you take it a bit wider and try to cut in? Does that work? Almost clipping that poor sign. I just ended up on the grass. I think it's going to be a fall for us. I don't think we're going to climb any higher than this. I don't think we are. Just doesn't seem like it will happen. The others... Well, I don't know. They could crash. They look quite bunched together. So, maybe. Oh, I two-wheeled that thing right there. Because of the Apex then, I... I just two-wheeled it. Two-wheeled the... What's this called again? Holden Toronto Forza Edition. Two-wheeled it. I am proud of that. I don't think I've done that before, like, by accident. Two-wheeling it from an apex, which I may, I may have, but just not noticed it. I definitely noticed that then. That was pretty nice. I am proud of that. You know when you're, like, really proud of just two-wheeling a car on a game? This guy slowed down in the Plymouth. Definitely I slowed down, but I don't know if we'll be able to catch him. Only two laps left. I don't know if we will. Got a bit of a lead on the guy behind. Yes, we have. But if we race well, we may have a chance getting that Plymouth. Especially if he makes a few mistakes. Oh, we almost made a mistake there, though. We almost did. Ah, shouldn't have gone straight into first gear, then. 
That was a bad move. Dropped from third to first almost instantly. And it almost... I think it redlined a little bit. It's just bad. Oh my god, the Plymouth has made a mistake. Plymouth is off. See, maybe... Maybe we could have a chance of overtaking him, but there's only one lap left, so I don't know. Maybe if he goes off on the next first corner, the one with all the sand on the left, that'll be our time to overtake the Plymouth and get into third, that will be. I don't think he will. No, like, people won't go off this late in the race on that corner because they've realised what speed they need to go and where and how they need to break. So, no one's going to be going off. I think that two-wheeled again. I really don't know. I think it did. It, it looked like it for a second. <laughs> it would be insane. I have to look back on the replay, see if it did. Plymouth drifting it there, maybe having a few mistakes. We're definitely catching up to that. Plymouth, if it was 10 laps, we may have had him. But fair enough, 7 laps. We've done quite well. Considering we could have had a big accident. We went off at the very start of the race on the first corner, which isn't the best. But we are across the line. There you go. Fourth place. Not bad at all, really. Well, it is because there's only like six of us, but anyway. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully, you did enjoy. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new around here. But until next time, guys, peace out. But I already know I'm going to get it now, though.